स्टूडेंट्स दिस वॉज द थर्ड क्वेश्चन आस्ट इन द इयर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी वन फ्रॉम द चैप्टर यूनिट्स एंड डायमेंशंस यू सी दिस चैप्टर इज सो मच इम्पोर्टेंट एवरी ईयर टू टू थ्री क्वेश्चन एंड समटाइम्स ऑल्सो फोर क्वेश्चन आर बींग आस्ट फ्रॉम दिस चैप्टर एंड वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व ऑल द यू क्वेस ऑफ द प्रीवियस थर्टी सिक्स ईयर्स स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम द ईयर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री द क्वेश्चन स्टेट्स इफ फोर्स एफ एक्सलेशन ए एंड टाइम टी आर चूज एन एज द फंडामेंटल क्वान्टिटीज फाइंड द डायमेंशन ऑफ एनर्जी ओके स्टूडेंट देन वील राइट दिस इक्वेशन ई इज इक्वल टू एफ टू द पावर ए एक्सलेशन ए टू द पावर बी and time t to the power c we have to find out the exponents of a b c so that we can write energy dimension in the form of f a t okay students what is the dimensions of the left hand side that is of energy we know that is m by 2 t minus 2 same as that of the work and what is the dimensions of force that is m l t minus 2 to the power a what is the dimensional formula for acceleration students that is you know acceleration is the rate of change of velocity and that is at t to the power minus 2 and time t is t so this becomes to them m to the power a l to the power a t to the power minus 2a Into n to the power b, t to the power minus two b, into t to the t to the power c. So let us write like this: m to the power a, l to the power here a, here b. So we write l to the power a plus b, and t to the power here minus two a plus here minus two b. So we write minus two a plus minus two b. That is minus two a minus two b plus c. Okay, student. Then we know from the homogeneity of the dimensions, the exponents or the dimensions of the left hand side must be equal to the dimensions of the physical quantities in the right hand side. So the exponent of m. What is the exponent of m here? That is one. Must be equal to the exponent of m in the right hand side. So a is equal to one. And what is the exponent of l here, student? That is a plus b. And in the left hand side, it is two. So a plus b is equal to two. So b is equal to two minus a is equal to two minus one is equal to one. And what is c, student? From this equation, we can find c. What is the exponent of T here, it is minus two. So minus two a minus two b plus c is equal to minus two, or c is equal to minus two plus two a plus two b. That is equal to minus two plus two into one plus two into one. This means minus two plus two plus two is equal to two. So the value of a we found is one, b is one, and c is two. We can write the exponents here in this formula to get the expression for energy in the form of f a and t. That is force, acceleration, and time. So student, we found a is equal to one. We write here one. We found b is equal to one. We write here one and C. We found C is equal to T. So this becomes F A T to the power two. Where is it? Where is it? Or this A is written as capital A. F A T to the power two. It is in C. So option C is correct, students.